All right, we just had one come over that we've been looking for for quite some time. It's in the MB Tracks camera system. We got a hit down here in the uh, underground parking garage. There it is right there. And this underground parking garage is too low for us to uh, get our truck into. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to get my go jacks down here, put the go jacks on the front tires, push it out. And I'm going to have to push it by myself all the way down here. <clears throat> all the way out to out here. To where the nose is sticking out. And then I'll be able to grab it from the truck right there. So I'm going to turn my truck around. Actually, I'll probably come over. No, it's going to be too narrow. I was say I could grab it over at this entrance, but this is going to be the closest one that I can get it to. <clears throat> grab the Gojacks. This is going to be a little bit of work, but big payoff. I'll uh, tell you guys the story behind this debtor and her husband in just a second. It's a really good story. It goes back about three years. Yeah, back in uh, 2008, had a repo order on a white Ford Escape for the girl that's driving this vehicle right here. And we actually repossessed it here at this hospital, which is above us. And when they made contact, she came out. She was a little psycho. We dealt with it. <clears throat> She got her personal property out. And eventually got the vehicle back. And then they didn't make another payment. So we got the repossession order again. located it at her house in the garage husband was there came out started fighting with us we already had the vehicle hooked and ready to roll I pulled out onto the street he jumps in it starts spinning the wheels until it comes popping off of my lift and we never saw it again last thing we saw was the brake lights through that vehicle disappear into the night. So, here I am three years later, running the camera system, we get a hit on this thing. MD Tracks calls us and says, this is an active one. And you guys spotted it 
down there at that medical plaza. They said, what's the name on it? As soon as he gave me the name, I knew who it was. Except for this time, the vehicle's registered in his name and she's driving it. So, Just about there.
And on top of all that, we have never seen that Ford Escape again. Check the registration on it. They have not re-registered it since 2008. So the finance company that we were picking that up for has been trying to serve them. And I've got those papers with me now because I knew I was going to be finding this vehicle and having some interaction with these Yahoo's. So now when they come out, I can serve them for that incident that happened back in 2008. Maybe we can get them into court and find out where that Ford Escape is. But first things first, which is getting this baby picked up right here. And they contact us to get their personal property out of this vehicle. We'll serve them. We'll get that on video too. When they come and contact us to get personal property out of this vehicle, we'll serve them with papers. First things first, get this thing secured for the empty track. We'll pull out here and get a picture of it. Send it over to the uh, collection officer to send us the information with today. Give me good news. All right, so we got the vehicle all loaded up. Had to stop and grab some fuel. You always want to make sure you never go to a repossession on an empty tank of gas because you never know what kind of complications you're going to run into. And uh, I was pretty low, but um, I carry spare gas on the back of my truck anyways. But we got it loaded up, got fueled up. There's the vehicle in the back right there. We've got it logged into our uh, online system as repossessed so that the finance company gets notified right away. And uh, I already did a condition report on it here on the laptop. And so we're just going to head towards the yard, get it all done. I want to give a quick shout out to my buddy August at uh, MB Track. He's the one that sent me over the link telling me that it was uh, ready to be picked up and it was in the system. It was uh, We'd gotten a historical hit on it. So uh, that's kind of what got us uh, sinking our teeth into this account. I was aware of it before because we had a, a competitor of ours that had this out and they weren't able to locate it. And so when it came up for us at MB Track's uh, system and uh, August sent it over to us, I had it uh, hooked within less than 24 hours based on the historical data in our system from running our camera system. I love that technology. I tell you what, it's only a matter of time until we've mapped most of the country and uh, those debtors and skips won't be able to hide anywhere. Underground parking garages, doesn't matter. We, we'll get you. We'll, you know, Keep running, keep hiding, keep loaning your vehicle to family members. Uh, run out of state, doesn't matter where you go, someone's going to pick you up eventually. These people are going to be totally surprised. And when they come to pick up their property, I got papers right there to serve them for another account because, you know, that's the kind of lifestyle they want to live and they think they can run from their problems. But uh, here's accountability right in your face.